Welcome back to the channel, guys. It is me, 87 for 4. So today, guys, we'll be doing a Premier League title race predictions. So we're going to be predicting every single game until the end of the season for the title race. And I'll give you guys what I think is going to happen, guys. So we have, obviously, Liverpool, Manchester City, and Arsenal. Okay? So I don't remember the last time we had a three-horse race. I believe the last time was, I think, the 15 and 16 season, which I think that was the season when Leicester City won the, the Premier League. So... That was, I think that was the last time we had a three-horse race, man. It's been so long, and I'm very much looking forward to it. So, we're going to start with match day uh, 30 uh, first. And, yeah, we're going to go ahead and get started. So, like I said, so Liverpool versus Brighton. I think Liverpool should win this. I think Liverpool should win this. I'm going to say Liverpool wins like a 3-1. Um, and, yeah. Then Man City versus Arsenal. Ooh, this is a tough one. A very tough match to call. At the time of recording this video, Man City have a lot of injuries. I think I think Walker is out. I think Stones might be injured. And I think KDB. Arsenal, Saka is injured, I think. And Martinelli, I think, is injured. Uh, this is a difficult one to call, guys. A very difficult one. I was originally going to say Man City to win this. But now that I see these injuries, I think I'm going to say a draw. I'm going to say 1-1 draw. Uh, I'm going to say 1-1, and I think it'll be a great result for Arsenal. If they could get a draw on the road, fantastic result for them. Moving on, we have the next one we got here is Manchester City versus Aston Villa. I think Manchester City should be able to win this. They're at home, you would expect. So I'm going to go with Manchester City to win. Actually, no, I need to do arsenal Luton Town. Arsenal should win that. All right, come on. That should be an easy win. I'm going to say 4-0 win for Arsenal. Uh, Manchester City versus Aston Villa. I think this will be a tight game. But I still think Man City is going to win this. I'm going to take a 1 0 win for Man City. Uh, the Liverpool versus Sheffield United. Liverpool should win this. This, this is easy. This is easy, man. E easy, easy peasy. So let me just calculate there. Okay. So Liverpool is first, 70 points. Arsenal second, 68. Man City, 67. Okay. The Crystal Palace away. This could be difficult for, um, for Manchester City, guys. This could be difficult because we know Manchester City typically struggles against Crystal Palace. I believe it's one of their bogey teams. Uh, I'm still gonna say Manchester City still wins this one, though. Um, I don't, I don't, I still feel like Manchester City have too much quality, so they should win that. Uh, then uh, Man United versus Liverpool. You know what? I think Man United is gonna win. I just feel like for me, Liverpool just are just really struggled at Old Trafford, and I just have a feeling it's gonna be a close one. It's going to be an exciting end-to-end -end game, but I think Man United is going to edge this. I could also be maybe see a draw. I can't. I don't see Liverpool winning it. So I'm going to say Man United 3, Liverpool 2. Uh, then Brighton, Hove, Albion versus Arsenal. This is a very this could be a tricky game for Arsenal, man. Tricky game. I'm going to say... I'm going to say Arsenal edges this one like a 2-3. I think they'll win 3-2 on the road. So as you can see, this is how the Premier League title race. And Arsenal is actually first right now. Liverpool second, Man City third. So look how tight it is, man. Tight it is. At the match day 33. Now we still have to go to match day 26. Uh, sorry, 29. Uh, that's going to take place April 24th. So I'm going to remember to do that. Uh, Liverpool versus Crystal Palace. Liverpool should win this. Uh, I do. I think Crystal Palace is also a bogey team for Liverpool, but I think Liverpool should win this. I'm going to say, I'm going to say a 3 1 win for Liverpool. I was actually, actually, you know what? I'm going to say 2 0 win. A 2 0 win for Liverpool. Arsenal versus Aston Villa. I think Arsenal will edge this one out. I'm going to take a 2-1 win for Arsenal against Aston Villa. Uh, then um, Man City versus Luton Town. This should be easy. Man City should be able to obliterate Luton Town. And let's see. Calculate there. And Arsenal still first, 74. And Liverpool second, 73. Man City, 73. Okay, match day 30, 34. So we got Tottenham versus Manchester City. This is always going to be a difficult game for Manchester City. We know Manchester City typically struggles against Tottenham. And I think they're going to, I don't, I think Manchester City will not get the result they want, but I think it's going to be a draw. I'm going to say 1 1 draw. And then um, we got here, it is Wolves versus Arsenal. Arsenal should win this one. I'm going to say they win this one 2 0 on the road. Um, yeah, and then. Um, Fulham versus Liverpool. Now, this is a tight game. I could see Liverpool screwing things up, but I, I do think Liverpool should win this one. I'm going to say a 2-1 win for Liverpool on the road. I think it's going to be a tight one. And, yeah. So, 76-74. So, Manchester City dropping points against Tottenham away could be detrimental. 
Uh, now we're going to go back to match day 29. And uh, then we got um, Arsenal versus Chelsea. This is a huge one, man. I'm going to say this one ends in a draw. Um, I just feel like Chelsea will be motivated. And Chelsea typically do well against big teams. So I'm going to say that's going to end in a draw. Uh, then I'm going to go Everton versus Liverpool. I'm going to say Ever uh, Liverpool wins this one. I'll say like a 1 0 win for Liverpool on the road. And then Brighton Hove Albion versus Manchester City. I'm going to say Manchester City wins this one. I'm going to say like a 4 2 win. So Liverpool is now first, Arsenal second, Man City third. 77. Okay. Match day 35. We got here. It is uh, West Ham versus Liverpool. I'm going to say Liverpool. I'm going to say Liverpool wins this one 2 1 on the road. A very tight one. Manchester City versus Nottingham Forest. I think Matt, I think Nottingham Forest. I think Manchester City is going to win this. I'll say like a 4 1 win for Manchester City. Uh, Tottenham versus Arsenal. I actually think Spurs will beat Arsenal. I actually think that's going to happen. I think Spurs will beat Arsenal. I just feel like the North London Derby, I think Spurs will do it. I think this will be a tight at this way close game, but I think Arsenal Tottenham will do it. So I'm gonna take a two one, a two one win for Tottenham. And if you can see right here, guys, Manchester City is now eighty points, Liverpool eighty two, having played the same amount of games. Then Liverpool versus Spurs. Hmm. Uh let's see. Manchester City versus Wolves. I think Manchester City is gonna win this one. I'm gonna say three two. Uh uh, the, uh, Arsenal versus Bournemouth. Arsenal should win this one. I'm going to say Arsenal wins 2-0. Uh, then, guys, I have a feeling that's Tottenham. I think Liverpool will beat Tottenham. I got I got Liverpool to edge with Tottenham just because they're at home. Uh, but it's going to be tight. Okay, match day 37. Then we got here. Fulham versus Manchester City. I think Manchester City will win 3-1 on the road. And the Aston Bullet versus Liverpool, guys. I can see Liverpool slipping up here because Aston Villa is really good, especially at home. I'm going to say Liverpool actually draws this game 1-1. One, one. Uh, then I'm going to say for the Arsenal game, Man United versus Arsenal. I think Man United is going to win that game. I'm going to say they win 3-1. Uh, actually, I'm going yeah, to say 3-1. I think they get revenge. And with this, man, Manchester City goes level on points and goes into the final match, Jay. Liverpool plays against Wolves. And I think Liverpool will win this one. That was like a 2-0 win against Liverpool Wolves. And then I think Manchester City will beat West Ham. I'm going to say Manchester City wins like 4-1. Uh, and then I think Arsenal will beat Everton. But it won't be enough. I don't think it will be enough. So as you can see right here, guys. I have Manchester City on 89 points. 27 wins. A draws and three losses. Liverpool at 89. Once again, man. And this time, it's not even points that decides it. It's actually literally literally goal difference. And look how close this is, guys. Look how close this is. I have Manchester City to win this by one goal one more goal score. One more goal difference. That is actually insane. So yeah, man, this will be a heartbreaking way for Liverpool to lose. But I just have a feeling this is gonna happen. So let me know what you guys think in the comments below, man. Do you guys agree with my predictions? Do you guys disagree with me? And yeah, um, hope you guys enjoyed. Please run a like and subscribe. And yeah, I'll see you guys later, man. Peace out.